word. This is a company that started back in 1920, so hence this is the 100th anniversary, but it basically means Eye of the Snakes. This has been an amazing, amazing company for many years, and today we are celebrating. I mean, when you've been a leader in the industry for about 100 years, there's a lot to be said for this. And by the way, they were the first cutting edge. So today we are giving you a serger. So for anyone out there who's like, well, what in the world is a serger? A serger basically is a machine that utilizes what is called an overlock stitch. So what it does, it literally trims the seams, right? And then encloses the edges of the fabric. So that's how it can be quite different from a regular sewing machine. Let me share with you. Sergers, so expensive. And we all know that you go out there to buy sergers, you can pay hundreds, hundreds and hundreds of dollars for a serger. Today, and by the way, I only have 248 of these, I think it is to go around. 241 from $399, $329, your price, a 25 year warranty that goes right along with it. You have a the VIP HSN on your you have your nine month VIP financing. It's only $36.55 there. We're gonna ship it to you for free. You will, we're gonna walk you through this, but this is a four thread, so you're gonna you're gonna be able to do so many different jobs. But again, the difference is instead of basic like a lot stitch that you have a sewing machine, um, your serger is going to do an overlock stitch. So it's going to trim it and then it finishes off all of the edges as well. So let me bring in our special guest celebrating 100th anniversary, Jennifer Tryon, who is our sewing expert. Happy anniversary. Well, thank you so much. I can't believe I'm celebrating 100 years. I know. Don't I, look so <laughs> I know. You look fabulous. <laughs> uh, that's so funny. But you know me, 100 years and this serger to be able to commemorate that anniversary, also to be able to get you in the door of having your own serger at this price point, this is amazing. You know, some people look at these machines and they always kind of wondered, what is that funny machine with all the knobs on the front? What does that do? Is it a sewing machine or what? But watch what it's doing. You see this tail here? There's a knife there. It's actually trimming the edge of my little leggings here. And what's happening is the serger allows you to work with hard to work with fabrics. So what's happened here is I'm able to main finish that seam. Look at that, it's gorgeous, very professional, but it maintains that stretch, which if you were um, trying to do something like this, well, you couldn't on a regular sewing machine, as soon as you walked, it would, it would pop. We've all been there. When you're making something yourself like leggings, you know, it's so easy to put a pair of leggings together yeah. um, with, you know, about a, a yard of fabric and your serger, and you just maintain that stretch. And now you've got that professional finish that you see in the um, garments that you get from the store. You can have that at home. But so often, Bob, so, so often people are afraid or intimidated by a right. serger because they're worried about threading it. But let me, let's go on a little tour of this machine so that you really can learn there's nothing to fear. First of all, it comes with the extended table, which is very rare for a serger. Normally you would only have this much space to work in, but check this out. It's coming with that extended table, an extra six inches of workspace or more. So I love this, but let's move that off to the side and open up the guts of the machine because this is where Janome says, we got nothing to hide all metal in here beware of plastic parts on sergers at this price point and sergers that don't allow you to access the left hand side mm. so if you're doing due diligence and shopping online and looking for something similar make sure if you're seeing around this price point can you open the left hand side because you need to be able to access this side for threading and for cleaning and often people are worried about threading a serger but let me tell you it's not as bad as you think and janome has gone ahead and put a thread guide right under the front cover here. So you don't have to get out your manual every time. In fact, everything is color coded. So there's a green dot, green. Everywhere you see green, you put that first thread. Everywhere you see orange, nice. you, you put this, or red, you put the second thread and so on. Blue, the third thread. Um, orange, the fourth thread. So you can do four threads or three threads in this serger, and it really is going to help you learn how to thread it along the way. 
it's not as fast to thread as a regular sewing machine because you've got four different components to thread, but it is doable. It's not impossible. And I love that you're able to get these professional results at home. And when you're surging with something, you know, like we talked about difficult fabrics to work with, this is the machine that's gonna allow you to open up that sewing journey for yourself and really get in there with some very cool projects. Oh yeah, without a doubt. And I did wanna remind everyone, when you look at, first and foremost, this is brand new, no one has seen it, $70 off, but it's actually $88 off because the shipping and handling on this is close to $18, so it's a huge savings today. I also wanted to let everybody know, earlier today, Ty had the kickoff of our National Sewing Month, and he had the matching sewing machine. So if you wanted to pick up the matching sewing machine to go with it, I really encourage you to do that. So there it is on hsn.com. That item number is 773-776 because I, I love that ability to be able to put the two of them together. Here's the thing. When you are looking at this serger also, you're also getting a lot of um, additional value added extras to come right along with it. You know, I love, again, that Jennifer just showed you the table, which is huge. You get four spools of thread. You're also going to get a general, the per, a general purpose a presser foot. Some of them are not up here on our board. You get two different screwdrivers. You get the needles that go with it. And you're also going to get the artistic a tweezer. That's a huge value add extra to go right along with it but you have everything you need and the, the thing and I'm so glad you talked about how intimidating because I've heard this from a lot of viewers who really feel like mm, I don't uh, uh, surgers frighten me I don't know are they easy to use I mean how simple and I uh, we love the fact that they not only do the job better because they literally give you a finished product but they're also so much faster aren't they Jennifer so fast. We're mm. talking upwards of 1,200 stitches per minute. These are little workhorse machines. You don't need to fear really pedal to the metal with the serger. It's made to run. It's also made for materials, like we said before, that are just almost impossible for your regular sewing machine, like faux fur or minky. If you're making costumes or baby blankets, what happens is they just shred as soon as you cut them. You know, you get your the back of your blanket ready or your costume pattern um, cut out, and then look at what happens. It just falls apart. And this is way too thick to be putting a regular seam in. So here's my tip for you. Take any weird, furry fabric like this and bring mm -hmm. it, the edges, before you sew it, to the serger first. What it's gonna do, you can see it right here, is yeah. trim off the excess, the part that's kind of shredding, and it's gonna lock all of those fibers in place with a row of stitches. And now look at the edge oh, of your faux great. fur. Yes, now your seam is gonna be totally encapsulated. You're not gonna be breathing in this fiber and it's right. gonna make this difficult to work with fabric much easier to sew with now. Yeah, great idea. And I know we even have up here like a couple of additional examples so you can actually see the difference in the finish of the edge that you you get created. So you can see, it, it basically, it gives you professional results each and every time, no matter, you know, no matter how many threads that you're working with. And you know, I say this to any of the viewers out there. If you have always wanted to own a serger, you, I mean, and listen, if you are a sewer, you really do need to have the serger because again, that's gonna give you that finished look, that more polished product. But here's the thing. We are celebrating our 100th anniversary of Janome, and I said they were the first. So if you've thought about it, you've gone out, you've done your comparison shopping, enjoy the fact that it's basically $80 off today. I know we don't have that many to go around. We started with only a little over 200, well, about 241. Get it home free shipping and then also remember you can take advantage of not only that flex pay i mean this is 65 dollars and 80 cents on any credit card without any interest maybe you want to buy it now put it away say look honey i'm buying this put it underneath the christmas tree for me or again even our hsn card particularly today with this amazing promo of every time you put 75 dollars in the card we give you 15 dollars. so you and you can utilize that with your hsn card your q card or your zulily card
card. But quick, simple, and easy. So question for you, Jennifer. What is the difference? I mean, because I know a lot of people will go, well, all right, so this is a four-thread serger. I've seen sergers that have like 12 threads. Will this will this do most of the work that I need it to do? Or do I need to, is that, is it? Of course. Okay. And in fact, <laughs> So you saw what a four thread stitch looks like. You showed it there. I'm using that because it's a stronger stitch for leggings. Okay. But let me show you how easy it is to switch to a three thread stitch. So I'm just going to take the thread out of my left hand needle and I'm just literally snipping it. No big deal. And I've taken that needle out. Now I've got three threads in the machine. And now what we can do is what's called a rolled hem. So we could do a regular stitch with three threads. It wouldn't be as strong as the four, or we could go ahead and put our machine in position to do a rolled hem, which is so nice and lovely to be able to do on napkins. And if you're wondering, okay, well, how do I achieve a rolled hem? In your manual, um, the book that comes with the machine, there is a guide. So if you're new to serging and thinking, oh my gosh, I don't even know if I could sew straight with this, let alone do a rolled hem. There's all sorts of pictures and guides to how you can do some of these, let's call them fancier stitches, but you'll see it doesn't take much more effort to do a rolled hem than it does anything else. And it's gonna show you in this guide, exactly, I love this page. You're gonna, you're gonna bookmark page 31 because it says if you wanna do a rolled hem or a pico edge or a narrow edge, it shows you exactly where to put all of the dials. So you wanna make sure you've got your bottom dial, your differential feet on one. Your, um, when you do a rolled hem, you wanna have your um, stitch length to R for rolled hem. And then it shows you where to put the dials to. So at seven, at three, at four, and at three, good. We pull back our stitch finger and now we've just got the one needle loaded there. Um, I've, we can re-engage the knife because the knife can go up or down just with the switch of the, the little wheel there. And now we're ready to take a woven fabric. See how this is sort of fraying on mm -hmm, the edge? Mm -hmm. But wouldn't that look nice on a holiday table as a yeah, napkin? Yeah, beautiful. Just that piece of cloth. Yeah, you can be making those yourself just by using this different stitch. And look at how fast we're going. Now, this is cutting off that edge. All of that stuff that's fraying is now getting totally overlocked and into place with this rolled hem. And I'm gonna show you the difference between what we're doing here on the rolled hem and your regular four thread or three thread because often people think, oh, the serger can only do one thing, but look at how nice yeah. and finished Beautiful. that looks on the outside now. Perfect. Compared to if we had to put like a seam mm -hmm. and then another seam, there'd be a big lump there. Mm -hmm. This is exactly how they do it at all yeah. of those linen stores where you're buying those napkins. Uh, I mean, for a yard of fabric, you could probably get 12 napkins <laughs> for what, five bucks? Yeah, exactly. And I did wanna show the viewers, the book you were using, Jennifer, you get it. So this is that instruction book. Uh, and, and right, I'm sorry I didn't have it out here before, but it comes with it. It talks about absolutely everything. There's the thread needle chart, narrow hemming. It goes through you know all the different test stitches. You get all of the information that you need and it comes right along with you. You know, I was thinking about the fact that I know a lot of people, you know, initially during COVID were home and like, okay, it, it was the perfect time to learn something new, right? And maybe you always wanted to sew. Maybe you were sewing years and years and years ago. Maybe you have the same machine you had from years ago and it's like, okay, it's time to update. Maybe you've never had a serger. I hope today will be the day you do it. I know we, have, we brought in really, really limited quantities, but the mere fact that we have it available, we have now only about 219 left that's it for the whole country you always have the full 30 days and listen you know even if you have I think like with the grandkids when the grandkids come over I'm like bored what are we gonna do with them you know stimulate the creativity I mean pull out some fabric make fun things I mean this is this is a great way to for you whether it's just you alone or you with your kids to be able to get away from the you know the the computers and the laptops and just have fun and be creative and to your point, Jennifer, think of the amazing holiday gifts, because those are the best kind of gifts, aren't they? I mean, something that somebody actually took the time to create. 
Well, if you're making napkins and go, and for the first time in maybe a year and a half, being able to go to some family member's house for Thanksgiving, what an amazing hostess gift to be able to yes. bring handmade napkins. Or what if you've got a little grandchild that would love a little bit of like Halloween wear? Um, we've been making leggings because, you, you know, working with stretch knits like this is just so fun. And you can attach the elastic so easily with the serger. Let me just show you here because this is really something. Once you have a serger, you're like, wow, does it ever do a lot of sewing jobs? So I've got the elastic here and what I'm gonna do is I'm actually trimming the little edge of the elastic and I'm stretching it as I go. And I'm gonna let this basically cover the entire waistband. See how I'm kind of stretching it? And now what's gonna happen is that elastic's gonna be permanently affixed to the edge of my leggings. Now, if I was doing this on a regular sewing machine, I might have to loop that elastic in with a safety pin and make a tunnel for it to go through. Not with the serger. The elastic is going to be completely secured around the edge of the waistband, the way they would do it with leggings from the store. So if you're wanting to make some cute, you know, seasonal PJ bottoms like this or little yeah. leggings for the little people in your life, get them to help. They can go on your lap. Trust me, the kids love pressing the foot pedal. I bet. <laughs> and you know what? They're not intimidated by the serger. They don't, they love making it go fast. And they absolutely love wearing things that they've made themselves. That's a great uh, which point. Which is so fun. Mm -hmm. And you're right about that. I mean, like I said, I mean, we're the ones that are intimidated, not the kids, right? <laughs> so here's the thing. We already have a clock that is up on the screen. We have more and more people that are jumping in. Today is the kickoff of National Sewing Month. We are celebrating the 100th anniversary of Janome here at HSN. And this is the only airing. I'm only airing because we didn't bring in that many. I mean, we brought in whatever we could. It's this awesome serger. I mentioned a little earlier, Ty had the matching machine to go with it. If you wanted to have both of them and match, you can go to hsn.com to see more of that and check out all the other Janome items that we have as we celebrate our 100th anniversary. Um, so there you can see also the regular sewing machine. If you want to pick that up, uh, the graphic that's on the screen is obviously still for the serger, but the machine is available at 100 $149. But here's the thing. Three, can I, in terms of using the thread, this is a four, three to four thread. So I can use it with either three threads or four, right? But you have to use at least three right. threads. Is that right, Jennifer? That's right. You okay. want to use three threads so that you've got um, enough, like there's two threads stitching in and to one lock. that's doing that looping. Got you it. always want to have one doing got the it. looping. Got and it. you know, a four thread, which is that thicker version right here, that's going to be great for leggings. A three, th because there's going to be lots of wear and tear. If you wanted to do something like an infinity scarf for the season, where you're just encapsulating something that um, is woven, it's not going to get a lot of wear and tear because it's just sort of around your neck. Three threads is fine for that. But honestly, I, I kind of feel like three thread, four thread, as long as it's overlocked, it's gonna be great. Right. And it's gonna be sturdy, and it's gonna be a stitch that you can't achieve in any other way. You're maintaining that stretch, or you're uh, stitching up the, those fraying edges, and that's just gonna make the sustainability of what you've made last just so much longer. Yeah, definitely. And then like you see, when you see the overlock stitch, you, you have the stretch, right? So you have the stretch throughout the entire garment. Because again, what the serger is doing, it's trimming off the edges. And then with that overlock stitch, it is locking it in, completely giving you that professional look. Awesome buy today with, uh, as we said, eight, basically $80 off because you see that you have the 70 off. No, wait a minute. Yeah, 70, 80, nine, almost $90 off because the shipping and handling is $18 on this. So I love the value. Value. I love the flex pay, a $65.80 on any credit card. There is absolutely no interest at all on flex pay, and that can be on any um, ad credit card, debit card, Apple Pay, and you have 30 days. So if you're already a Janome lover, maybe you've been dedicated to this brand, like I said, they were the first. Here's your chance to maybe pick up 
that first searcher or update your machine. We have the heavy duty machine that'll be coming up in just a matter of minutes, but this is the only airing of the searcher. Comes with a lot of goodies. We didn't actually have them all to put out here, but you get a lot of great things to go with it. Those artistic tweezers, uh, which are another really uh, important value added for this particular configuration. And the book, the instruction book down here, comes with it. So uh, you are not alone, right? You have the opportunity to walk through it. And, and it's, and I, what I think I like about the book also, Jennifer, it's explained very succinctly, right? In ways that you can understand and easily follow. Absolutely. Absolutely. And Janome has gone ahead and put the instructions on how to thread the machine right in the window. So even if you don't want to have to get out the book every single time, what you need to know to use the machine is right where you need it. This thread guide is right there under the lip of the machine. So you're gonna be good to go. You're not gonna waste time if you have to rethread it. But for the most part, you leave a neutral color in your serger, like white, gray, tan, mm -hmm. and you kind of just surge with whatever's there and it's always ready to go. I love that about the serger. And I love the 25 year warranty that you also get that goes right along with it as well. So that is 773777. So definitely stay right here, but we are gonna come right back with that awesome heavy duty machine.